Okay class, today we're going to show you how to do multiplying matrices using a TI-84. And so the first thing we do is look at the question. Now we should always look at how many rows and how many columns. And we should determine if that's even possible. And this is a 3 by 1 and a 3 by 2. And so if you remember the rules, this is not possible to multiply. But let's go ahead and pretend we don't know that. Um, let's try to do this with our matrix multiplication inside our calculator. So we're going to go to second matrix. And um, you can see I've actually already put these in, but you can go over to edit. So you scroll to the right, pick edit, and I pick the first matrix A. When you hit enter, then you see that's three rows by one column. And I went ahead and put in the data negative three, five, and one. You would do that just by scrolling. Um, you would scroll over to it and you would type in negative three, enter, negative five, enter, and then one, enter. To, uh, then to do the next one, you just go back to second matrix and you would put the data under edit. You would go to the second matrix B and you would edit that. So we put in a matrix that's a three by two and then you have three rows and you type in eight, seven, seven, negative two. Remember to use the negative sign, not the minus sign. One and one. And so we have those defined. And then you do second quit to exit that. Now to multiply matrix A by matrix B, you would go to second matrix, you'd pick matrix A, and then you multiply just by putting it next to it. So the second matrix, matrix B. And then you can multiply. So let's hit enter. But notice you get an error. It says dimension mismatched. And if you read down here, it says check the size or dimension of your matrices. And so you notice that I said we cannot multiply this. This would be called, um, um, you would just say uh, undefined. And so you don't want to do something like that. Let's go ahead and do this next one. This is a two rows by three columns and three rows by one column. Can we do two by three and three by one? Yes, because the threes match on the inside, we were left with a two by one. And so our result when multiplying these two would be a two by one matrix. Let's go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna do the, I'm gonna quit this error Let's go ahead and redefine our A and our B. So I'm going to say second matrix A. Let's go to edit it. We're going to edit to be a two rows and three columns. And then the numbers we want to put in is negative three, enter, eight, four, negative seven, four, and negative five. And so we've put that information in. And you can second quit. Um, and then we want to do our second matrix. So second matrix, we're going to go to edit. And we're going to do B. And so this one was going to be three rows by one column. And we're going to put the information in. That's negative one, eight, and negative six. And so now we've entered that. We'll do second quit to get back to our first screen. And now we're going to multiply our first matrix by our second matrix. So once again, I'm going to say matrix A times matrix B. And now when I do this multiplication, I should get a matrix that is two by one. And so you see it has two rows and it has one column, and the answer is 43, and the data inside this matrix is 43 and 69. And so it's done all the multiplication for you.